Hey guys, Justin here. I'm in Tin Moon Ferry Pier right now. And not taking trains this time, we're taking buses. Yes. According to the caption. Uh, oh man. Okay. Uh, quick run. Yes, I'm just going to do a quick run because I don't know the caption. But we're taking 59M today to Chunwan Station, which we also have 59X that goes to Mong Kok East Station. That's the longer version of 59M. But it's not the same. These two routes have slight path difference inside this area before heading up to Chunwan Road. This one will loop Wu King Estate instead of following the light rail track, while 59M will be following the light rail track all the way from here, which light rail is right there, to Long Moon Station and then it will head up to Tunmen Road and then it will just drop down from after hit Chin Wan instead of like 59X will continue its way without dropping down to Chin Wan and then continue its way to Meifu and then all the way to Mong Kok. So we take 59M, very very short route around uh, definitely within 30 minutes I think we can complete this thing. $9.20 very very cheap so in terms of things actually going far. So thank you so much Joshua Chan for this request here. Don't tell me this guy, oh my gosh, look at this. That guy's ending his days, so that's why he just parked right there. The stand is right here. So, is he ending the day or he's, is he the next service? He's coming out to probably mark down his shift over there. But I think this should be the next service here. So, UF5792. More terrible MMCs, but whatever. <laughs> 歡迎乘搭九龍巴士公司五十九M線，本班車將由屯門馬頭開往荃灣站，中途將有廣播提示各位乘客落車。祝各位旅途愉快。Dear passengers, on behalf of Kowloon Motorbus Company, I would like to welcome you on board our route number fifty-nine M to Chunwan Station. Further announcements will be made as we approach various midway bus stops. It is our pleasure to have you on board and we wish you a pleasant journey. 各位乘客,欢迎乘坐九龙巴士公司 Now, if we're 59x, it turns there, but we're not 59x, so. Every 10 to 15 minutes right now for rush hours. Right. Oh, okay. This is so confusing. Red there and then green this way. What? The next stop is Melody Garden. Decent minibus there and 259D. Where should we going outbound? Yep. I mean inbound to Le Yu Moon. West uh, eastbound. Melody Gardens right there, and here's Melody Garden stop for light rail. More 44 mini buses, not the uh, Horizons West route, which is gone now. Oh, we're literally following this 506. Oh my gosh! Mm. Maybe we can run ahead here as soon as these cars actually go up because 506 is one of the cheapest route, and definitely right. tons of people taking it. Volvo B90L over there. Yep, we're running ahead. 
and we stop at the frontier. For sure there will be people boarding. That's a lot of people who cut it out. Ah. And unfortunate. Just missed the delay. The next stop is Butterfly Station. Phase 3 coming in. That's the rarest train. That's the rarest light rail type now. Literally the rarest. We don't see many Phase 3s. 615P here, completely packed. Oh my gosh, it's so full. Because there's always one car for these. Not always, but like very rarely we have more than one car. And we have a Phase 4 back here, 615. We should be following behind, what the hell. <laughs> phase 4 though, that's also rare. Not common. Mostly Phase 1s, of course. And then Phase 5 actually has more than Phase 3 even. So. so. We are have at Butterfly Station. Now, KMB call them station, but MTR call them stops. So, whatever. And of course, a lot of people will cut it out again. Oh my gosh, just go, dude. Freaking hell. The next stop is Sun Tun Moon Center. I think the uh, 59 X turns back out right at the front over there. So. Which there are deviating trips that actually start from, I think, here. Actually, no, 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 no. Now, there are some deviating trips that from other places. I think some ones start from Long Moon Oasis and it loops back to Tumen Ferry Pier and then continues way there. That's in the morning. But normal trip is this one, of course. And we have some other ones, I don't know, but yeah. Red light. And yes, the 59X turned back out already. So that's why it will stop at this stop. It turns back out at one earlier street after looping Wuking Estate. I'm checking on the deviating trips for this one. Oh, we have a crew bus. That's a crew bus. Now, on the shift for the Canby drivers, they actually will list out you need to do a crew bus. <laughs> Which is the worst shift of all times because there are so many stops and stop at the stops that to pick up the dudes to go to work. So that's why that's so awkward. I'm checking on the 59M deviating trips here. Oh, what the hell? No. Normal is that. We have Chichiman Station morning peak departure. Monday to Saturday, starting from Yutvu Villa. And it will skip everything and it just goes straight to here and then continues away. And then the other one is actually starting from Lomon Oasis. Oh, no. It starts from here, Sun Tun Moon Center, and then it just goes straight out. So, yep. That's why I said there's a deviant trip that starts here. The next stop is Long Moon Station. And then after that, the next stop is just bus and the changes, isn't it? We should be stopping. Yep. 
Now it's nine dollars twenty cents, but if you're just traveling inside Tun Moon, you can get a real ferry bait, but it's not on the bus. You actually need to for this stop. Actually, you have to go across to the other side road to get your rebate at the other stop over that side. So you will pay the full fare first, and since you get off, you can get a fare rebate processor at the stop. You tap your card and you get your fare back. So I rather they actually do it on the bus, which is actually way easier because there are other routes, some other places they actually do it on the bus. So. Hey, Tunmun Kung Lao Jin Tae Dam. The next stop is Tunmun Road Interchange. Next stop is Tunmun Kung Lao Jin Tae Dam. And this is a cheap route, so it's always recommended to take a cheap route up to Tunmun Road Interchange if you want to change. So then you're not going to pay over because if you pay a cheaper route first and you take an expensive route for your second trip, then you pay overall the expensive trip. But if you take an expensive trip at the start and then you take the second trip is a cheaper one, then you ended up actually paying the expensive one. So that's why this is nine dollars twenty cents, and if you change to a like a thirteen dollar route, then you just pay the difference for the second trip. So overall, you just pay the thirteen dollars. So like for example, if the next trip is thirteen dollars and then this one is nine dollars twenty cents, then as soon as you change an interchange, it will cost you three dollars eighty for the next trip. But if you ended up taking like a thirteen dollar trip first, then you pay thirteen dollars since you bought that one, and then you change to this one nine dollars twenty, then it will be zero for this one. But ended up you pay thirteen, which is over nine dollars twenty. So, oh, and here's the problem of Tunmun Road during peak. On Tunmun Road itself is not terrible, but this is the nightmare part. Before you turn onto Tunmun Road, it's nightmare traffic. Absolutely terrible this traffic. Yeah, this traffic is one of the worst. But after you go through this traffic, it's actually pretty smooth. So that's why. The problem of this is actually just when the things actually need to turn into Tun Moon. So that's why it's jammed here. But for turning onto Tun Moon Road, it's actually pretty smooth. Oh man. Okay. Here we go. You see, at the front is already not jamming. It's just at the front the car is actually trying to turn in, so it's getting a little bit jammed. You see, this is also why it's so terrible, you see? There are buses actually in the inner lane because there is the 263, the last video, inside there when it comes back up and it needs to cross over to this lane which causes massive problems but it's just this spot other spots are fine so, this is the nightmare part after this part is all fine on Tun Moon Road so, after Tun Moon Road is already Tun Moon and then that's it for this route short route easy peasy so that's why if you want to go to Tun Moon take these way cheaper just try to get a seat if you don't get a seat it's miserable to stand through the whole Tun Moon Road but if you want to take from, like for example, Chin Wan over here with trains, there are no good connection. Literally no good connection. No trains, so you have to just take buses. Nine dollars twenty. If you take trains, it's over ten dollars. That's for sure. So that's why taking buses somehow is actually the better option if you want to go to Chin Moon. Don't take MTR. It's pretty trash in my opinion in terms of the price and also the time needed. You see. It's getting better now with the traffic. Not too jamming now. It's just this lane is terrible, so that's why it's just causing this lane also is terrible. But after we go past this part, it's all right. You see? Oh my gosh, this lane is so bad. But our lane is smooth now. It's time. Let's go. Unfortunately, still no good buses. Ugh. I really want some better buses like a V6X or like like a B8L. Oh, these are way better. And of course, electric buses. Oh, 
what the hell is that? That's a bus by CLP Power. What? Oh, that was pretty cool. Probably some of the retired buses have sold to CLP Power or something. Because there's an Enviro 500 over there. Oh. Oh, and on the Tumor Road. Should be pretty quick now. They shouldn't be jamming here. It's all the way to Tumor Road. And after that will be Chunwan. And then there are like three stops inside Chunwan, including the terminus. So two mid stops and the terminus, Chunwan Station. And I will just empty our back. I do want to take 30 eggs back, but it's a little late, so... Because tomorrow I'll be going to up, up north to Shenzhen again, so I, find I ended up... I actually originally wanted to film these things tomorrow, but... Yeah, not possible. Because tomorrow I need to go to Shenzhen, so... But tomorrow I have Shenzhen videos again. I will film them, hopefully it's cool, hopefully safe. If not, it's gonna be annoying. Because I'm on my own this time. It's 2858P over there. Rush hour route. Okay, we got some traffic issues here. What the hell is with these two buses here? What the hell is with these two buses? Back at the front, so so another CLP power bus. Yeah, those are some of the withdrawn buses from before. Oh, it's just some of the uh, MTR buses because of the numbers up there. 317? Yeah, it's just an MTR bus that got converted over. Yeah, I can see the seats inside. It's still the MTR color. Oh, they have all changed to the CLP power color. Okay, cool. Now, last video was also Tumen Road. But it's fine, it's the other direction this time. And we have the bus lane here. Oh man, what the hell? <laughs> Truck died in the middle of the road here. Very smooth. It's E6 X over there, I think. And their interchange for sure because it is the stop for you to do interchange. This is the route for you to take if you want to interchange. So, now, you can take 59x to change as well. It's not too bad the price. It's thirteen dollars for fifty nine eggs, but if you're interested to take even further and more express routes, it's definitely over fifteen. So that's why you can still have an interchange. So that one's fine, but you cannot take fifty nine a. Fifty nine a does not stop at Timmin Road bus interchange, which is stupid. I don't know why they don't. Why not? So fifty nine a doesn't stop, and fifty eight x also doesn't stop. So which is weird, considering every single thing stops around. It's just the two routes that name run straight through. I guess it's good, then you're not going to get interrupted, but still. More good buses over that way. These Alexander Dennis ones, though. So, uh, I really want to change right here to my 260X and I can go right back. But I can't because I need to film the route, so. Uh, mm. Please hold the handrail. This is the stu most stupid system of all times. They play two times in Cantonese, please hold the handrail, and then they play another full set of announcements, please hold the handrail. 
，俾至少即係個摩聽，呢個係係同。And Tumen Road Interchange. This is the other side. Towards the city. Got buses over there. Two five two coming in here. Is it two five two? Two five two is the short route that connects So Kun Wat for interchange over here. It's very very popular route. I can't see it. Literally can't see it. Literally this freaking this 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 the shelter is blocking everything. Our stop is actually right there. I think we're done now. Oh, 61M over there. Also short route. Yep, we're done with the stay with the stop. No one's boarding. So. The next stop is Chunking Circuit Flyover. 下一站是全景为天桥 ，and that's the、uh, Tumen Road interchange towards Tumen direction. It's actually very far away. You can walk on the ground underneath to go there, or you can take a two five two over there from the city direction stop to the count to the Tumen direction stop. That's what the two five two does. Two five two terminates at the Tumen Road interchange, Tumen direction, but underneath the bridge, not on the highway here. So. Of course, not just that. It goes to So Kun Wat, which is a uh, nearby area. That's basically it. Yep. Now we take all the way. It's actually very pretty. Actually, like this. If it's sun setting, it's also even prettier. But not sunset right now. And change affairs. Four dollars eighty. But the four dollars eighty is kind of pointless considering it's just basically two stops. 係啊，呢冇問題嘅，即係你同我講。Taking the same path over to Chunmon. 係啊，咁我就知啦，因為。Oh, this is going east, so we won't be able to see the sun. Damn. The sun is behind us. Because behind us is west, so. 龍門區係咁唔係，即係全部我哋前前都前都封守。Sixty-seven A going to Kwai Fong, Kwai Chui Estate. Why is going that way though? 佢窗啊，全部一齊做嘅。That one should be also taking the old road. It should cross back over here. Oh, yes. They are on the wrong lane right now. They need to cross back over. Fortunately, they can't cross. And there's that stupid CLP bus. That's just a crew, crew bus. So, probably. We have two lanes for the buses. One will go up to Tinkao Bridge to go express out, while the lower path will be going to Chun Wan. And of course, it can, you don't need to get off at Chun Wan. You can continue on the highway to go up to Kwai Chong and Mei Fu, all of that area. Which some of the routes actually does that? So, YM eight three four three, very very brand new. Oof, wow, this sudden cut back over. Holy crap. Should be a pretty quick route, hopefully within 30 to 35 minutes. I do know that my filming style actually does actually cause the screen to actually shake quite a lot. But the thing is, this is part of the experience, you know? Because when, we, you know, when you're taking buses, for sure it's gonna shake. For sure it's not gonna be like completely still and no shaking. So that's why if I actually have my phone actually slightly shaky like this, it just actually feels like I'm actually taking a bus. And I mean, not me. You guys are also taking a bus when you're actually take, watching the video, so. I think I actually like this way way better than actually a still, a still spot without actually having any movements. See? When you're like having some slight shaking like this, it just seems like we are taking the bus together when you're watching the video. So that's why. They can feel how shaky this path is as well. Not very shaky right now, but yeah. Now imagine we're gonna see single deckers on on Timon Road. Probably not though, but 
Yeah, it should be all double deckers here running on Tillman Road. Nine sixty over there. Cross Harbour route. I'm still used to saying 960 to Curtin University bus station. <laughs> not here. It's just the same numbers, but it's not the same thing, dude. Mm, 961. Going to Tun Moon as well. Of course, all of these things are going to Tun Moon. And oh my gosh, was that? Uh, that's an LPG one, though. But that's a 19C, so it's not too bad. Okay, the driver is way too fast, so the, it's beeping down there. Continue using the Wi-Fi, these buses are so good, I like these. Although it's pretty boring every single time, but I don't care, Wi-Fi is life. Don't need to use data. Tun Moon 50 half day service. Learn is also flying back to Hong Kong, so that's why. Fortunately, when this video is out, for sure, uh, we're already all back to Perth, and he's back to Australia as well, so that's why. But it's just saying that we hopefully can film some videos together. I'm not so sure. Yeah, but we're going to Shenzhen. He also wants to go to Shenzhen, so that's why he's probably also going to be going there to film some videos. So, here's the low road, we have the high road already branched off up there That's going to the uh, Tinka Bridge We're going this way to continue our way That's just a uh, not in service, but the driver doesn't bother actually changing the desk though. Because the 960 doesn't go this way, we'll go on to Tinkar Bridge for 960, so that's why. So, lazy driver doesn't switch off the desk though. I don't know where he's going, probably another shift. In Chinwan. Driving down the Shimon now. We got an egg over there. Just saw an egg driving on the other side of the road. This guy is uh, good to switch that off, the desk though. But here we are at Chunmuan, we're turning down now. Not too bad of a route, we're getting dark now, so that's why I want to end this quickly. There's Belvedere Gardens. 
of Chinwan, which there's around 40 of there. Very, very miserable, that 40. Literally the, one of the terrible routes. It literally goes from Chinwan all the way to Lam Tin. I mean Kuntong, Laguna City. Very, very long route. I've tried it one time in the middle of Chinwan all the way to Laguna City, it took me over an hour. And if you are oh, those guys are just actually getting through to other spots, that's the path continue on the highway. We drop down now to Chinwan. Made it now. And then just a couple more stops. I don't remember the stop's name actually. Hang on, let me check it out. One hand typing the password when the bus is shaking is one of the hardest things to do. There we go. Made it down. We have a stop here at the front over there. Yes, people are getting off. And we have another stop at Discovery Park and then it's Chinman Station. There's a stop. There's someone boarding. Holy crap. Using the $4.60 fare, which is the cheapest fare that you can get right now, I think. The next stop is Discovery Park. Now we do have a Discovery Park bus terminus, which there are routes terminates there. Which is that one, 930X terminated at Discovery Park. And also we have the E31 that also terminates here. Airport route, not airport. That one's just go to Yatung Estate. It's just a Tung Chung route. It's not an airport route. Ah. Oh. There's Discovery Park. Thirty-four. Thirty-four. Not my local route here. It's one of the worst routes too. It moves so far inside this area. Thirty-four. <laughs> Inside Chun Wan. We got some rush hour specials going around now. I also saw okay. 53 single decker. That thing is gonna take at least two hours before it hits Yun Long. So it's gonna arrive at Yun Long probably now it's it just departed. So at uh, at the front at near Chun Wan. So it probably departed five minutes ago, set five fifty. So probably that thing is going to arrive at Yunlong at 7.50, yes. <laughs> a total of 70 something stops, it would take over 2 hours for that one. So it's probably going to reach the end before 8pm, 8, 8, 8 probably can reach there before 8 o'clock but... <laughs> oh my gosh, at least they use single deckers, it's not too bad to drive through that. But that's, one of the, that's the longest route of all times, traveling. <laughs> And here we are, made it to Chinman Station. We need to loop into the bus terminus though. 235, circular route to Onyam. And uh, not circular. Oh no, that's the circular. That's just Chinman circular. Here's the stop. Right there. I'm turning it now. E32A. Adam, hey, Chinman Dam. The next stop is Chinwan Station. Now it would be better actually for me to go to Chinwan West Station, but here is not Chinwan West Station, which is not good. So, eh, yeah, it would be better to go to Chinwan West Station because I can just take uh, just take Chinwan Line from there instead. Right now, I need to take Chinwan Line first. Thirty nine M here. 
said actually right now I need to take twenty uh two more line and I need to take Tung Tung line and then I can change it to my line. Okay. Fortunately. Is there a connection over that I can do? I don't think so. Let's just take. It's fine. We'll take made it. It's jammed all here, so we're just gonna get off in the middle of the road. You see the whole bus turn this is just jammed because this guy parked here. So as I end off we just start off right here. So he's going back now to Moon Fairy Pier. But they don't call them Tim Moon Fairy Pier for Camp B, they call them Tim Moon Pier Head, which is so weird. Why not just stick with the same name? But Tim Moon Station, here we are. A lot of routes here. Oh. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe. Click the bell so that you can get notifications when I post. 34M, what the hell is that route? I've never seen that thing before. I need to look for an end exit. I think there's one at the front. Actually, I don't know, but I saw a random exit earlier on. I don't know where it is. I think there should be one at the front. Let's just go there. 34M, what is that? Oh my gosh, because there's Chun Wan. I just saw all of the minibuses. <laughs> Chun Wan has one of the worst. Chun Wan has like almost all of the worst minibuses. So that's why <laughs> all of them are so trash. I just gotta take this up. We can go to the train station from there. I want to check that 34M. What the hell is that? Chunwan Station Circular from Bayview Gardens. Okay, never seen that before. Oh, what? Oh, it's broken anyways. I can walk it. Check out the links in the description down below for my other channels and my Instagram. Click on this video up top, and I'll see you guys next time.